Good morning and welcome back to Goa Walks. We are Lifetime Travel Mates. In this series of Goa Walks, I'm trying to show you the beauty of Goa, the place where we've been for the past almost two years. On today's episode, I'm going to show you the area of Saligao, the Circle of Dreams. Everybody calls it Nagoa Circle. There's no like big shops. Everything around here is more like small supermarkets like this. Oh my God, this one is also beautiful. Look at this. I'm not sure if we can call it gentrified. Yeah, Saligao is quite the, not the touristy area by the beach, but still cool enough, nice enough. I read it was like a global village. Oh my God, this, look at this. This one is also beautiful. So this goes to the Nagua Circle I was showing you at the beginning of this episode. We're gonna continue walking a bit more. And here we have, as you see already, some beautiful houses. Oh my God. Across the road, but just to show you, it's nice, right? This is one of the this cute, cute roads of Saligao. Church here that I never seen open. It looks a bit abandoned. I mean, look at the garden, and there's not much parking for people to drop a car or bikes. We have a kind of a heritage house. This looks much more gone than before. Still no seats outside, but it's, it's beautiful. What else do we have here? This one looks also very nice. I don't know why they cover it in plastic like that, but uh, the garden looks well taken care of. And it's big. Look at those windows with a kind of a roof to protect the window. Nice. And then we have a house that doesn't look that gone. Still cute. And look at this. So many plants. Oh my god. Okay, let's continue. We have here a car and bike wash. Of course, many people move around with bikes and cars, so. Gotta keep it clean from all, all that muck from muddy roads and all that stuff. And Sunday is a good day to do your, you know, cleaning and washing your car and bike. Sunday is still a very important day, you know. Big part of Goa is Christian, Catholic. So Sunday is still church day, you know, family day, resting day, of course. And we reach one of my favorite spots here on this road. It's this new road. Cool mural. I like the colors, I like the style, kind of rough, you know, a bit rough strokes. And it's on a wall of a house, actually. I'm not sure if that's a house or a gallery or something, but from here we can see this cute, cute entrance. And this is very good one. This house is called Maya, if I'm not wrong. And you can see these typical seats on the entrance. I'll show you before this. It's very going. And look at this narrow alley here. Going somewhere. I don't know where. Never adventured this far. So let's take a look. Where does this go? Okay, it's a dead end. Oh, no, no, no. It continues. Continues this way. Another house with a white and another color combination. Ooh, okay, I've never been on this road. It's new for me. Oh, someone is drying chilies. Look at this. And now, yeah, now it looks like a dead end. Still, it's beautiful, it's refreshing because it's a bit. There's a bit of shade here. Since it's a new area, I just hope dogs don't come after me. Because you know what happens when you go to a new alley and you don't know if doggies are there. Okay, this house called Delani, 1989. It's cute. Pretty big. I like the curvy wall there. Nice entrance. And views to the fields that we're gonna see soon because we're gonna go all around that way and explore a bit more of this Saligao. As you can see, we still are 
covered by coconut trees and other nice and tall trees. It's breezy here and <laughs> look at this image, man. This is why we love Goa and Salego. This is small, you know, beautiful corners to explore. And right in front of this, you can see more construction, more buildings, more development. That's not development, that's fixing probably some electricity pole there. Something's going on here. Oh, it looks like the, that fell. That electricity pole fell. What is that? This is the... Good morning. Cambridge Assessment International Education. I'm not sure if this is a... Just an institute. I don't know, it looks nice. What else do we have here? So, this is the kind of end of the narrow road. And now we have a opening here. Ooh. We have an opening with the fields and all. Quite beautiful. It's fresh. I can feel fresh air. And the sky, oh my god, the sky is beautiful today. Finally. There's no signs of rain, no dark clouds in the sky. Yeah, uh, I love it. Look at that thing out there. It's beautiful. And we're gonna head to this way because we are heading to the Saligao Church. Huge church near the Saligao Circle. And this is a kind of a shortcut. I mean, we could go that road and the main road, but it's gonna take too long. So instead of that, we're gonna take this shortcut. We're gonna cross this small village. I mean, we're still in Saligao, but there's a bunch of houses here. Maybe some villas as well. I don't remember if there's any beautiful house, but we check, yeah. This is a very quiet area. I'm very astonished by this huge villa. I guess it's a villa. That doesn't look go on, but it's impressive indeed. Just on the other side, a little bit of a parking space. But oh wow. Look at this. There's another mask on the entrance. This looks like the mask of Kerala. The other one from the traditional dance. I might be wrong, of course. Now our entrance to a small house. But then we have like this huge, I don't know, would you call this a mansion or village house? Morning. It's huge, it's nice, and these two. Wow, this is, uh, yeah, some luxury here, man. Some luxury. A big well, pretty big well. What's in there? All right. We're going to continue. Oh, wow, this looks pretty abandoned. Look at this garden, this house. Okay, this looks pretty abandoned. This area, this house too. The garden is not trimmed at all. It's super wild because the monsoons make everything grow so fast, right? And we are reaching, we are almost there. Near the Saligao church. Of course, barking doggies. Doggy! Yeah. Are you friendly? Are you friendly? Well, I have to go, sorry. I have to go. Sorry. Go, go, go to mommy. Go. And another person. Sorry, oh my god. Come, 
I'm sorry, I always cause a little bit of chaos whatever are animals in the street. <laughs> oh, it's fresh again. Shade, that's what I needed. Good morning. How are you? Good. Ooh, what is this? This is a farm that I never seen before. It's kind of a greenhouse or whatever, covered farm. No, no most of the times I see uh, fields never covered. But this is kind of new to me. Yeah, I don't know what they are growing in here. Let's take a look. I can't recognize that plant. I can't recognize. I don't know what is that. Whatever the thing I say, I might be wrong, so I better don't say anything. And let you guess, leave a comment, what is those? What is that plant that's growing in this farm? Plant or tree maybe, who knows? Right? But it's big, it's a, it has a few, you know, one, two, three, four, five at least. Five of these greenhouses. And we are almost there, almost there. I'm gonna take this one and head to the church. Oh wow, new construction, but the windows are kind of traditional look. And here you can see there's a lot going on, pretty big. I don't know what is this building. You think it's a villa, a stay, or I don't know if there is a roof up there. I mean, there's going to be a roof. Looks very recent building. I mean, started recently, right? All right, so it seems we are arriving at the beautiful and big Saligao church. Since it's Sunday, maybe there's some activity, there's some people outside, but right now I don't see anybody. Maybe it's too hot and too late in the day. Maybe early morning there was a mass, but now everybody's gone home having lunch, taking a siesta, which is something I should do too. We can enter this way, yeah? Let's enter this way. And since there's no one around, I'm gonna remove the mask for a while, because, you know, it gets hot and sweaty. Oh, no videography inside the church. Okay, I wasn't planning though, but thanks for the warning. So this is the Madre de Deus, Mother of God. Madre de Deus, Madre de Deus Church. I guess they are using this pandemic times with less people to fix the whole area. This used to be like a big plot of grass that now it's a bit, well, as you can see, being fixed or being changed. There's a bunch of those brown rocks there. Maybe to become floor or some kind of wall or something. But that's it. Saligal Church, Mare de Deus. Mare de Deus Church. Yeah. Oh, it says tourists are not allowed. Religious service on. Yeah, you see? Tourists are not allowed, okay? I wasn't planning to enter, but... Anyway, let's continue. I like this. On the first episode, when we were in St. Anne's Church in Parra, I said how I love, like, white buildings, white churches next to coconut trees. And views like this. Like this. I mean, <laughs> not this. Sorry, those fields. Yes, nice. We're gonna head a little bit this way, because there's another road I want to show you, which is super beautiful. Look, another one of those trees that I mentioned before. Okay, so we are leaving the church. You wanna take a last look? Okay, this is, has a nice sunset, because the sunset... The sun sets uh, somewhere there, not that side, but that side. So you can get quite good photos of the sunset and the church. Yeah. 
Okay, we're gonna continue. Oh, there's a parking lot here. I guess for the church. What is it? Morat Moratia de Gama. Looks like a house or I don't know, but beautiful. It's uh, weirdly quiet, too quiet for a for a day off like a Sunday. Maybe because I think today it's still the Onam Sadia. No, 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 never mind. That, that's not celebrated in Goa. I mean, it doesn't have this big, much of an impact to keep the streets empty like this. No, I don't know. Maybe because it's past the church time. And yeah, we are heading again to on a crowded road, so mass on again. So this is another road, but since I'm on a tight schedule today, I'm gonna show you that on another episode. Just a sneak peek. We're gonna visit here next time. Super beautiful road, and then we're gonna enter to more Saligao roads. And now we're gonna head to Saligao Circle. And maybe start there on the next day. Start from here, from Saligao Circle. Alright, so I hope you enjoy this episode of Goa Walks. If you like it, please give it a thumbs up. And if you love it, subscribe to this channel and consider joining the membership so you will help us and support this channel even more and we can keep creating contents like this. Thank you so much and see you on the next one. Bye!